You don't think it's a coincidence that your uncle showed up when he did? No, I don't. It was that psychic Delfina telling me that I wasn't alone. That's what started this whole thing. The whack job conjured the guy up or something? No. But remember when I started trying to look up any family I might have? Yeah, but you didn't send him one of those letters, right? I mean, that's what you told me. Yeah, no, I didn't. But I wanted it so much. I think I made it happen. Oh, that's a well, crock. No, well, okay, well, why else would he be here then? The dude just got out of prison. He, he needed a new start in life, and your parents left you a lot of money. Oh, God. All I know is this is not your fault. Marco's right, okay? You did not make this guy just appear, even though that would be really great because you can send him back to where he came from. God, if only we knew somebody that could do that. I'm not out to destroy Dorian. I don't do things like that. But if I were, could you blame me? Cole, she used a loophole in the company bylaws to take away everything that my father spent a lifetime building. Okay, so why are you doing it? Let me ask you something, huh? Do you miss your dad? Yeah, of course I do. Yeah. So you loved him, did you? A lot. What if he had given you something that he treasured? Something that he wanted you to pass down to your children and to their children? Wouldn't you do everything you could to hold on to that? Well, I've never been put in that position. Haven't you? What about your child, huh? That's your father's blood. That's your father's legacy. I know you fought to keep that baby and how hard it was for you to give it all up. You know, I'm thinking, you and I, we're not that different. I don't know about that. But what I do know is Langston's my friend. And she's a mess right now. Some lawyer says she has to move away to Columbia with some guy she just met. So I'm gonna tell Dr. Lord about you and Langston's uncle. Son, I don't think you want to do that. Well, look who's here. Didn't I once drag you out of a dumpster? What did you do now? Did what I had to do. I saved him. This time I saved him. Guard, that man that you brought in here, what did you bring him in for? Shot some guy named Rex Balsam. Rex Balsam? My daughter's married to him. Is he all right? My son-in-law's condition serious? All I know is he's still in the hospital. Oh. Want me to call over there? Yes, please. Addie, and, 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 and let me know if you find out anything right away. You really are worried. Oh, well, yes. Despite everything that's happened, Adriana loves him. And she's... I'll call her, too. No, 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 no. Please, Addie, Addie. Do not call Adriana. Uh, not until we know for certain. We don't want to worry her unnecessarily. Rex was shot, Dorian. She'd want to know. Okay. But choose your words very carefully, because Adriana is going to be devastated. What's the matter with that judge that put you in here? How could he not see what a loving mother you are? I just can't stand it. Adriana and Langston need me, and, and, and I can't be there for them. Wade, if Dorian isn't out of jail by now, I don't think she's getting out tonight. I'm staying here with you. What? What about your parents? Just got off the phone with them, told them what was going on. I'm not leaving you, Lang. I'm spending every minute with you until... for as long as I can. 
Look, we have all night to think of something. There has to be some way to stop your uncle from taking you. <sighs> I just don't know what. You can't just give up. What else am I supposed to do? What we need is a miracle. So give me one reason why I shouldn't tell everyone that you're screwing up Langston to nail Dr. Lord. For the simple reason that it's not true. I am not involved in any dealings that would hurt Langston. You're not afraid of me, are you? No, sir. Well, that's good. Because I like you, Cole, and I've enjoyed having you around here. You've liked living here, haven't you? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Nor and I have been good to you and given you everything you need. You're a bright young man. You've got a wonderful future in front of you. And maybe that future would include the Buchanan family. You know something, Cole? I value loyalty. I reward loyalty. You hear what I'm saying, don't you? Loud and clear. Get the real us, and we're not letting you go. Oh, I can't go. I don't know what I'd do without you guys. You think that's Dr. Lord? Kid gone. I handled him. Mm -hmm. So is he on to what we're doing? Doesn't make a damn bit of difference if he is. You have full and legal custody of Langston, and you're going to be taking that girl back to Columbia with you. And there's not anything anybody can do to stop you. Wait. Yeah, I did. What, is something wrong? Yes. Clint Buchanan brought Ray Montez to Lambview. What? Why? To take you away from Dr. Lord. I've just got to get out of here. I have to be there for my girls. I'll see what Blair's doing about that. I'm... And I'll find out what I can about Rex. And Langston, too. I can't imagine what she must be going through. You're not going to lose her, Doria. I promise you that. I'll come through for you the way you came through for me all those years. If it hurts, it can heal. <laughs> 